So matapos nga ang grabing pagkatalo ng Los Angeles Lakers kahapon sa Phoenix Suns sa kanilang Game 5 matchup, ito nga ang reaksyon ni Lebron James matapos ang pagkatalo nila na yon. Panoorin nyo nga ang kanyang sinabi. I don't, I don't know. I mean, we got our ass kicked. I mean, it's just that simple. Um, they did, got to whatever they wanted to get to in this game and uh, you know, we got to be better obviously if we want to force a game seven. So, um, obviously a lot to uh, learn from in this game, a lot to cover. See, uh, you know, what we got to do better going into game six, but uh, I mean, they, they pretty much just kicked their asses. I mean, it's nothing else really to say. I, I don't know. I mean, off right now, you know, just got to watch some more film and seeing ways we can, um, you know, try to exploit some of their overhelp in. Um, I mean, we were getting some really good looks. We're just, just not making shots. We're literally just not making shots. And, um, you know, it's my job to get guys open looks and finding guys and putting guys in rhythm, you know, and also staying in rhythm myself. But we're just not making many shots. And, uh, so ito nga si Lebron James ay remains positive para sa kanyang team kahit na in the brink sila ng going home early dahil 3-2 na nga ang kalamangan ng Phoenix Suns at kapag natalo nga sila bukas ay tapos na ang season nila at hindi na nila madedefend ang kanilang NBA title. At ito rin isa pang player na natalo kahapon matapos nga ang napaka historic na performance na ni Damian Lillard against sa Denver Nuggets kinapos pa nga rin sila at hindi nila nakuha ang panalo kaya nga sila rin ay down na nga rin 3-2 sa series na ito. Ito panoorin nyo nga ang very disappointed Damian Lillard sa kanyang post game interview. Tough loss, man. We, I mean, it's do or die now, so we gotta win both of the next two games if we wanna, if we want our season to continue. Simple as that. I mean, at this point, all that matters is we can't lose another game in this series. So we go out there, we play to win the game, and uh, we came up short. So. Going back home is a must win or else our season is over. At ngayong araw nga para sa ating susunod na topic, may dalawang NBA team na nga ang napauwi, ang Washington Wizards at pati na rin itong New York Knicks. Sa first game nga natin, ang Philadelphia ay nanalo 129 to 112. Wala nga dito si Joel Embiid dahil sa injury pero itong si Seth Curry at si Tobias Harris ay binuhat nga ang kanilang team na Sixers. Si Curry nagtala nga at umiscore na ang 30 points at meron siyang dalawang assist si Tobias Harris. 28 points, 9 rebounds at 6 na assist. Ito naman si Ben Simmons ay may triple double, 19 points. 10 rebounds at 11 assists at nagresulta nga yung mga performance na yan sa pagkapanalo nila 129 to 112 ito naman si Brady Bill nagtara ng 32 points si Westbrook ay may 24 points so ito ang Wizards ay napauwi na nga na maaga ng Philadelphia 76ers at kakaharapin naman na Sixers ang nanalo nga sa next game natin na Atlanta Hawks at syempre, speaking of Atlanta Hawks, pinauwi na rin nila itong New York Knicks ng maaga. Ang final score nga ay 103-89 to si Trey Young. Grabe ang performance with 36 points at 9 assists at dapat na rebounds. Dinagdaga naman ni DeAndre Hunter ng 15 points. Si Clint Capella ay may 14 points and 15 rebounds naman. At si John Collins ay may 13 points para naman sa Atlanta Hawks. At ang leading score naman ng New York Knicks ay itong si Julius Randle with 23 points. So natapos na nga ang season ngayong araw na itong ang New York Knicks at pati rin Washington Wizards at magre-ready na nga sila para sa off-season. So yun nga lang guys para sa video natin ngayon. If you guys like the video, make sure to like the video and if you're not subscribed, syempre, subscribe na dahil everyday meron tayong mga NBA updates. So yun lamang, see you guys next video. Bye!